Hi hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is part two. I'm just going to take a look at uh, some of the differences between the um, Broadway Limited Imports Challenger and the Atherin Challenger and the MTH Challenger. <coughs> the, M the MTH and the Atherin are in uh, the Greyhound uh, paint scheme or livery. They are both uh, cab number 3977. Um, the Broadway Limited Imports um, is cab number uh, 3829. So it's a different uh, um, cab number and different paint, paint scheme. Um, I like the Greyhound paint scheme better. Um, but in terms of smoke generators, uh, um, the Broadway Limited Imports, I don't have it on a live truck right now, so you can't see the smoke generator on. Um, but it does have a very good smoke generator. The and it's timed with a chuff, um, so synchronized smoke. Um, the uh, MTH also has a very very good smoke generator. Um, I actually find it's better than the Broadway. Um, a lot of people would argue that. Um, and then the Atherin is just um, well, sorry, the, the MTH also has uh synchronized chuffing smoke um now the atherin does not it just has two soy type smoke generators <clears throat> i'm just going to bring it a little bit forward so you can take a closer look uh, just a little bit more and that's what they look like um i always have an issue of how much uh smoke fluid how much smoke fluid I need to put in there um, I don't think there's any any uh, best system out there um, so and a lot of times um, I fill it and it's over it, it, it's overfilled so <clears throat> I'm not sure uh, the exact amount um, so right now they are on. I might put some more. I'm going to add a little bit more and see what happens. Maybe I'm, I've added too much. So I'm like, oh, oh, this one's starting to take off here. So maybe I didn't have enough. That's interesting. I, let's see if we blow into it. It'll get started. There we go. <clears throat> Anyway, I might have too much. Let's see if I, if, what happens if I take some out. I'm just gonna draw some out. Let's see what happens. Oh, I think it's getting better. Oops. Let's draw some out of this one. Oh, actually this one is completely dry, so we're gonna put some in. Oh. Anyway, they're, there you have it. You never know how much uh, is perfect. Sometimes they run, sometimes they don't run great. It's hit and miss, whereas the MTH is very consistent. Um, the Broadway also is uh, much more consistent than the Atherin. And actually the sounds of the Atherin I don't like uh, either. They're very, very tinny. Oh, no, it's starting there. And then let's try the bell. And I don't think the detail is as great as the, uh, or as good as the MTH. This is the MTH. That's the Atherin. And the Broadway is over there, uh, in behind the Atherin. I, I don't have it on a, I don't have it on the live track right now, so I can't uh, move it. Maybe I'll just move the Atherin out of the way. Okay, that's the Broadway. It's not on right now. Like I said, it's not on the live track. Let's uh, move the Atherin back in. Oops. Yeah, I just put it back in position there. Put it on forward. Yeah, so there you have it. 
um, this is part two of my comparison. Um, like I said in my next video, I'll be looking at the UP9000 series <coughs> fixed frame. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye for now.